was at a bit of a flaw. She was very disappointed to miss the gala performance last night. So today, by way of compensation, we've arranged her own special visit to the theatre. It's a unique, very personal theatre run by actor-manager Marcel Steiner. And Judy, I think, is already in the orchestra stall. Oh, you know. Hamlet? It's only the eighth, isn't it? Oh, uh, oh, it is. Shall well, I find out? Oh. There'll be an enforced intermission now. Enjoy your interval chocolate okay. while I don't enjoy it. Oh, it's not at all. Q U E E N Queen. I shall make you my queen. <laughs> Sorry, could I just interrupt a moment? Would you uh, like to. <laughs> This, they tell me this is, it says on here, the smallest theatre in the world. Marcel Steiner, Henry VIII, how do you do? Geraldine Marsh, nice to talk to you. Now, you wrote this. Uh, I co-wrote it, yes. The play, what he, what he wrote. You uh, co-wrote the play. <laughs> Come on. Now, what's the name of the play? The Private Wives of Henry VIII. The Private Wives of Henry mm. VIII. Mm. Now, it's not the kind of grandiose performance you would expect in the smallest theatre in the world, is it? I, I think so, yes. <laughs> not not one. <more. laughs> How long has this still been going? Because if you can't see it, I should explain to you. It's actually attached to a motorbike. This is the biggest sidecar in the world, even though it's the smallest theatre yeah, in the world. There's a motorbike round the other side. Yeah. Do you actually drive this to the venues that you play at? Yes, 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 indeed we do. Yes. And how long have you been playing at it? Uh, driving it? Yes. Um, 20 years, 20 years. So the smallest theatre in the world is 20 years 20 old? 20 years old, yes. Yeah. But presumably you always get full houses, do you? Oh, yes. Well, I mean, <laughs> we can't play without a full capacity, can we? Is that, there's only one seat. How did the idea come about? Well, you just you just put your finger on it, really. I mean, it, it beats the inflation problem, doesn't it? <laughs> I mean, if if you only need one person, then you can't help but actually fall to pay to a full capacity, and they pay you, so you can do it. Yeah. I can't imagine. You, you, do you charge as high a price as Covent Garden for your seats? Oh, we can do. Yes, it depends, <laughs> it depends on the occasion. Oh, yeah, is about ninety-eight. Pounds. I think a hundred pounds is the dearest. That you've ever charged? Yes, yes, the most we've ever It's remarkably self content You've got lighting here from the studio. Have you got your own lighting system? Yes, we have. Yes, yes. There's a lighting grid at the back there. You can't quite see it, but we use the lights, yes. Have you had any sort of famous audiences in there? I mean, do you have gala performances here? As uh, like the famous audiences. Well, we've, 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 Terry Wogan, of course, we've had Terry. Oh, he's not famous. Um, <laughs> well, other, other, other showbiz personalities have been yeah. in there, but. Um, uh, no, no, no royalty yet. Yes, well, we, you yes. live in hope, don't you? This is the Private Wives of Henry VIII. What other plays do you tour with, Joni? Um, well, there have been in the past, maybe, Pride of Two Cities, um, Shakespeare from Notre Dame. Mm, several Shakespeare. Yeah. Mm. The facilities in terms of on stage and backstage are not exactly enormous, are they? I mean, yeah. that is the stage. No, yeah, oh. I know. We, we have to make do, yeah. basically. You actually master the art of Bentley acting, you see. You, 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 you <laughs> stand <laughs> like that, yeah. yeah. Would you like? Um, we're being quite tall, this is both mm, Yeah, we are. Yeah. Yeah, yes, you are. It's not exactly made for you, is it? And oh, it is. It's it, just, it's it, just big enough. Just yeah. right for you. Yeah. Is this a touring production? I mean, well, it's obviously touring because it's mm. got wheels. But mm. do you go around places in the summer? Can people oh, yes, spot yes, you? Yes. yes. Uh, anywhere, anywhere we're booked, we just go. We're, you know. You go anywhere yeah, for one anywhere. seat, yes. yes. I mean, if there's anybody that wants to book us for a private function, like, um, you know... We'd... Oh, that's the end of the advert. Right, well, look... No, no. <laughs> you just go wherever we're... You go wherever you're booked. Cool, yeah. Press your throttle and away yeah, you we go. Take, we take the venue to the people rather than the people having to come to us. It's a very sensible yeah. idea. In the intermission, Madam didn't come back after the interval. Oh. Can I go? Would you like to carry on? And I'll, I'll, I'll watch. Oh. So, The Private Wives of Henry VIII, Part 2. And I'll get back <laughs> 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 See how sweet our child be. It is another girl. Yes, how? I shall call her Elizabeth and she shall be great. But you promised me a son and heir. But. Uh, but next time, how? Madam, there shall be no next time. I'm cursed! <laughs> cursed! <laughs> 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 